rate is uh, below seven. Well, that's good. That's fantastic for a spinner. Yeah! The impetuous Brendan McCollum pays the price. That was not the shot that the New Zealand skipper needed to play there. A touch of magic from Roman Health. Oh, Sri Lanka are not as yet. That is a gem of a delivery and not so well played by Brendan McCollum. He's gone for more. It's 18 for two. I was convinced. What? Oh, what about this one? Yes, this one. Strikes a second time. You see the minus touch tonight for Sri Lanka. Ross Taylor's gonna go. It's a five-ball dunk. Oh, he's not doing What is going on here? Herath. Herath has just tormented New Zealand. Nation's gone first ball. The stadium has gone mad. It's 23 for four. Oh, that's close. That's good. That's good. Absolute beauty. Stunning performance. You could work for that if it pitched in line. You were gone. And look at them celebrate. Herath is all over New Zealand like a rash. Rookie's gone for two. 29 for five. Four for three. the catch, Herath takes five, this has been an unbelievable response and performance by Rangana Herath and Sri Lanka, listen to these figures, 3.3, 3, 18 footballs, 5 for 3, as New Zealand a ball that for 60, 60 for 9, Anderson got that, and it's a win. belong on what a beauty great response from Rangana Herath spun the ball past the outside edge and Sri Lanka make the breakthrough great response by Rangana Herath that's the experience so we're talking about just enough to beat the outside edge and clipping that off stump and ah! it's all about the fence and that's a big shout and gone Nigel Long says that's good enough for me Goes back, actually starts to go forward, but then really has got nowhere just beyond the crease. Herath appeals and Nigel Long. Ah! Oh, he's out. He's nicked it. Well, pick it for Herath. Why well, bowl full and straight when you can bowl short and wide and still get the same result? That is a big edge off the bottom of the bat, and it was a really good catch by Joey Wardenup because that was. That is a beauty, and it's all over for Dougie Bracewell. And uh, Bracewell couldn't negotiate it. Again, half forward. Look at that catch. Good sharp chance taken. Two-handed catch by Mahela Jawadana. So good at slip. Oh, bowled him. There goes the fifth wicket for Regana Harath. He's bowled beautifully today. And but this he just didn't pick up. Fired in. It's a Yorker goes for the big sweep and plays all over it. So Rangana here at reading the play. Oh, he goes big. It's gone all the way for six. Brendan McCullum looking to be positive. So quick on his feet. We saw this in the first innings. Occasionally, Harath got it short. Look how deep in the crease McCullum got. Now this is high. And it's going to fall safe, is it? Kulasekara comes around, he takes it! Sri Lanka have got the wicket they wanted. Disappointing, this one just held up a touch. McCullum looking to repeat the shot from earlier in the over. Got to say, Kulasekara did really well. McCullum's gone for 13, New Zealand 18. Uh, an underage. Oh, that okay. is a beauty. You're going to see more of those delivered. Here on day three, 50 for three here. Oh, 
Oh, oh that's nicely bowled past the outside edge. A bit of bounce and turn there for Rangana Herath. Encouraging signs for him. It's an interesting uh, field setting, uh, Craig. Perhaps we can expand on that after this next delivery. Ah! An appeal for LBW. And Taylor's been given half forward and umpire Nigel Long having no hesitation at all there up goes the finger and a hammer blow for the blow. and this is the one that just continues on with the arm look at that straight on and that looked pretty good Taylor playing for a little bit of spin before every test series this side went on again an appeal for LBW umpire Nigel Long has a long think about it in the end though says not out 68 for four This is the last delivery of the previous over to James Franklin. Not the worst shout, you have to say. Good stride in, which probably saved him there. Decent stride in his big boy legs, so plenty of gaps. <laughs> Stumped. Franklin's come down. Just a fumble, and I think we're going to go upstairs to check, but I don't think this is going to be good news for James Franklin. Skips down the pitch. And Prasanna Jai Wardner drops the ball onto the stumps. And there's confirmation of the dismissal. Oh, Got him! There it was, just waiting for it, the sucker punch. He's got the desired result as Rangana here. Tossed up slightly and slightly wider. He's been bowling from around the wicket, pitching in line with the stumps. But this time... To be, yes, straight away. He's on a hat trick, gone for a golden one. Yeah, slid in quicker, lower arm as well. Didn't have to look up, could have kept walking. The Rangana Harris is the slider, arm ball, and back and across. And uh, well, I think even uh, all jokes aside, we were appealing. Full delivery again, that is uh, swept by Van Vake and he was straighter than the delivery that bowled Van Vake in the first innings that ended up getting under the bat and hitting off stump. There it was there, too full, too quick. That is... Gone, is he just like that? Another golden one. Highlights for Sri Lanka, Rangana Harath was a class above. His epic series started in the first test in Palakale when he took four wickets in the first innings and a bag of five in the second. Over the top? No, he doesn't. Straight. Oh, he's bowled him. Nice. Oh, that's close. On to the second test in goal. Harath was on song in the first innings, claiming four for 34. His second innings reaped just two wickets, those of Joe Burns and Mitchell Stark. But things only got better for the veteran in the final test in Colombo. Harath took six wickets in Australia's first innings. And picked up another seven in the second, as Sri Lanka completed a series whitewash. Oh, that's beautifully bowled. Five days, I think. Eight. Out. Harath finished with 13 wickets for the match, the most ever by a Sri Lankan in a test against Australia. Does in the end. That's a toy shout. It's given. That's it. He also claimed the prize wicket of Australia skipper Steve Smith. One down. That's number one. Sammy Aslam's gone. Of this uh, test match unfolding. Yeah, just down the wrong line. Didn't do a lot at all. But he's always at you, Rangana Harith. There is three number 395 in terms of test wickets. Rangana Harith. First one down. Oh, gone. Now, this is brilliant from Rangana Harith. He saw the length. 
He wanted to climb into it, but the ball kept coming at him. Bounced. Had nowhere to go as a Chafik. Great grab. Karnaratna. Yeah, fingers pointing upwards. Oh, so much time to gather it in the end. Let's celebrate, says Dick Muller. It was almost in slow motion. From over the stumps. Invited that uh, shot from Safras. Hit his pad. Missed initially by the keeper, but he was a mile outside the crease. And so I had no time really to get back in the crease. And so... Yeah! Bold him. Number eight, Ranganeherath picks up his fourth. Reason why he was bowling over the wicket. Behind the legs. Just the perfect length. Just... Done him, done him. Ranganeherath got five. That Rattled the stumps out of the rough. Mohamed Ahmed thought he had got this line covered. There's a gap between bat and pad and... What dramatic end to this uh, innings and Rangana Harith in the process. Yeah! Oh yes, out oh, caught that time, that time, <laughs> that time. Let me let me call it. You just relax. We can celebrate. <laughs> Rangana Harith will become the first left-arm spinner in the world to get 400 Test wickets. I wouldn't want to talk too early. Let's see. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, yes, yes. This time, there's no doubt at all. So, Rangana Herat cashing in on Dilruan Pereira's mistake. He gets 400 wickets in Sri Lanka, records a famous victory, beating Pakistan by 22 runs. And, in fact, it happens to be Pakistan's uh, smallest margin of defeat. They had lost by 23 runs to Zimbabwe, and they lose by 22 runs here. In fact, 21. And gone, and gone. Well, Jonathan.